a realm where the sun's light never reaches, where pressures would crush a human in seconds, and where creatures have evolved in ways that seem almost alien. This is the deep sea, Earth's final frontier, and today we're diving into the abyss to meet the most bizarre, terrifying, and mind-blowing deep sea creatures ever discovered. Get ready for a journey into the unknown. If there's one deep sea creature that haunts people's nightmares, it's the anglerfish. With its terrifying teeth, ghostly bioluminescent lure dangling from its head, and eerie blank stare, this predator is straight out of a horror movie. But what makes it even scarier is that it doesn't chase its food. Its victims come to it. In the pitch black abyss, light is irresistible. Smaller fish, mesmerized by the glow, swim closer until it's too late. The anglerfish has a highly expandable stomach, allowing it to swallow prey nearly twice its own size in a single bite. But here's something even weirder. Male anglerfish are tiny compared to females, sometimes only one-tenth the size. And instead of hunting, they have only one purpose, finding a female. When they do, they bite her body, fusing with her over time. Their organs degenerate, their bloodstreams merge, and they essentially become one. He provides sperm while she keeps him alive. The Goblin Shark, a deep-sea predator that looks like a prehistoric monster. And in many ways, it is. This species has remained unchanged for over 125 million years, a time when dinosaurs still roamed the Earth. Goblin sharks are rarely seen by humans. They live at depths of more than 1,300 meters. It doesn't rely on eyesight. Instead, its long, flattened snout is packed with electroreceptors, allowing it to sense the electrical signals of fish swimming nearby, even in complete darkness. Unlike most sharks, the goblin shark's jaws are loosely connected to its skull with specialized ligaments. When it attacks, it launches its entire mouth forward like a harpoon, trapping prey in its needle-like teeth before snapping back into place. This process happens in less than a second. It's rare, it's ancient, and it's downright bizarre. This is the vampire squid, and while its name sounds terrifying, it's actually one of the most unique creatures in the deep. It has evolved to survive in one of the harshest environments on Earth, the oxygen-poor twilight zone of the ocean, between 600 to 900 meters deep. Despite its spooky name, the vampire squid doesn't suck blood. Instead, it survives on marine snow, a mix of decaying matter and tiny organisms falling from above. But it does have a fantastic trick up its sleeve, or rather its tentacles the cloak defense. When threatened, the vampire squid flips its arms inside out, exposing rows of spiky, glowing tentacles. This freaks out predators and makes it look far bigger than it really is. Its Latin name literally means vampire squid from hell. Meet the giant isopod, a deep-sea armored survivor that looks like it crawled straight out of prehistory, as they haven't changed much in 160 million years. This deep-sea scavenger is related to pill bugs, but grows up to 76 centimeters long. These scavengers survive by feasting on whatever falls to the ocean floor, whale carcasses, fish remains, or even sunken ships. Some have been known to attack live fish, including sharks in rare cases. But here's the crazy part. Giant isopods can survive for up to five years without eating. When they do find food, they stuff themselves until they can't even move. Their slow metabolism allows them to endure long periods of starvation, making them some of the most patient creatures on Earth. Giant isopods can curl into a ball for protection, and their tough exoskeleton protects them from deep-sea pressure and predators. In a world of terrifying deep-sea creatures, one stands out as undeniably adorable. The Dumbo Octopus, named after the famous Disney elephant. 
With its large floppy fins resembling elephant ears, this little cephalopod looks like something straight out of a cartoon. Unlike most octopuses, the Dumbo octopus doesn't rely on jet propulsion. Instead, it glides gracefully through the water, using its ear-like fins to steer. Living deeper than any other known octopus species, at depths of nearly 13,000 feet, the Dumbo octopus has evolved unique survival strategies. It has no ink sac because, at such depths, there aren't many large predators to escape from. And instead of chasing food, it hovers just above the seafloor, using its webbed tentacles to trap small crustaceans and worms before swallowing them whole. At those depths, the pressure is intense, but this little guy is perfectly adapted to the crushing environment. The fangtooth fish might not be the largest predator in the deep, but it has one of the most intimidating appearances. This terrifying fish gets its name from its oversized fangs, which are so large they interlock awkwardly, giving it a permanently fierce appearance. In fact, it has the largest teeth-to-body ratio of any known fish in the ocean. Despite growing only about six inches long, its dagger-like fangs make it look far bigger and more fearsome. It's a relentless hunter, using its incredible sense of smell to locate prey in pitch-black waters. Because food is scarce in the deep, the fangtooth fish attacks anything it can fit in its mouth, using its powerful bite to crush crustaceans, squid, and even other fish. And this fish is a true deep sea monster. It can survive at depths of 5,000 meters, where few other predators dare to go. If you've ever wondered what it would be like to see inside an animal's head, meet the Baralai fish. This bizarre deep-sea creature has a completely transparent skull, revealing its glowing, green-tinted eyes inside. But the weirdness doesn't stop there. Unlike normal fish, which have fixed eyes, the Baralai's tubular eyes can actually rotate inside its head, giving it a full view of its surroundings. When hunting, it stares straight up, watching for bioluminescent prey drifting from above. This adaptation is incredibly rare and allows it to spot food that other predators might miss. And if that wasn't strange enough, scientists believe its transparent skull helps it gather more light in the darkness. The deep sea is full of creatures that defy logic. With every new expedition, we uncover new species, bizarre adaptations, and mysteries we can't explain. With over 80% of the ocean unexplored, the question remains, what else is waiting to be discovered? Now, if I told you that a flying fox isn't a fox, a bear that's not a bear, and a mountain chicken isn't even a chicken, curious? Then check out the animals that lied to us about their names. Click the video on your screen to find out more. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and join us next time for more mind-blowing discoveries.